begin this noon with that tragedy in Bayonne. Two teenage brothers drown in a school swimming pool. CBS News' Natalie Dudrich is live now with the very latest on this developing story. Natalie. Well, Chris and Mary, the young men's names are not being released at this time. The mayor says to give the family privacy as they deal with this tragedy. We spoke to school students this morning who say that they are in disbelief and they're asking how this could have happened, especially when police say there were lifeguards here on duty. I feel devastated. I feel heartbroken because I have a grandchild go here. Community members are trying to comprehend how two teenage brothers, 16 and 19, drowned at Lincoln Community School's indoor pool Wednesday night. Why wasn't somebody, like, kind of watching them more? For something that, like that to just happen in the public, it's such an open area. Like, the pool is, like, just, you know, it's so large. But it's like you can oversee the entire thing. For that to happen, it's just, like, it's unbelievable. According to witnesses, just after 8 p.m., the two teens appeared to be in distress in the deep end of the pool. Police say three lifeguards on duty jumped in to try and rescue the young men. They were able to pull them out and perform CPR until first responders arrived and took over life-saving measures. They rushed the boys to Bayonne Medical Center, but they could not be revived. Especially both the brothers. Like, my heart pours out for the family. Like, as a mother, I could only imagine her heartache, how she's grieving. Police say a third sibling was present but was not injured. The school superintendent sent an email to students at Bayonne High School saying one brother was a recent graduate, the other was a current student, and offered crisis and guidance counselors to all Bayonne schools today. Losing two of your sons, it seems very heartbreaking. Um, but I know everybody else is really sad about it. I know they were friends of people. So it must be hard. According to the pool's website, there is an open swim 7 to 9 p.m. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Officials say the pool will be closed to all activities until further notice. Police are now investigating. We are live in Bayonne, New Jersey. Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News. Natalie, thank you. Well